Welcome to the 2022 Wheelchair Comparison, brought to you by the Christopher and Dana Reeve Foundation and Gold Pictures. We're going to show the features of each chair individually and then compare them all in the final episode. So stay tuned. We're super excited about the introduction of the Nitrum chair uh, to the market because we feel is the uh, next generation ultra lightweight rigid wheelchair that uh, it basically took everything that was good from the older product and we took the, uh, the voice of the customer and basically combined it and, and that's where the Nitrum came came about. Um, there's two versions of the Nitrum. We have the open cantilever frame Nitrum, and then we have the Nitrum hybrid, which is our basically our dual to box, box technology. A unique difference between Nitrum and Nitrum hybrid, it's the, uh, the weight capacity. The regular Nitrum can go up to 275 pounds of weight capacity, where the uh, Nitrum hybrid is uh, 300 pounds. I think the main features I would look for are um, easiness and like putting in the car. Your transport weight comes out of everything uh, that you can remove the components out of the wheelchair, meaning you remove any tips, you remove the armrests, you remove the actual wheels. So on a regular Nitrum, the open frame Nitrum, the actual 16 by 16 configuration basically is, is less than 11 pounds. And the Nitrum Hybrid, after you remove all the things, it comes out easily right around 13 pounds. So really, that's the 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 transport way that you that you're transferring in and out uh, when you're trying to get in and out of your vehicle. Yeah, this feels really good. Normally, when you have a traditional aluminum side guard, they're usually fixed. So one of the main features that we introduced with the Nitrum chair is a flip back side guard option that you can easily use. So if somebody's trying to transfer side to side in and out of the chair, you can easily just uh, push back the side guard, having the entire area for you to you to actually move side to side and doing your transfers. Biggie Nitrum has these like little headlights that I think are super cool and would be so helpful for going out at night, um, just being like out on the streets when it's dark. We basically now have lights on a manual chair. Um, the Nitrum is using LED lights integrated into the actual frame, and it's using the calf strap in order to have the little battery box. So it's really cool because you have these LED lights that are mounted below the, uh, the caster link. And we purposely chose that location because one of the things that we saw during the design of the, of the lights for the chair is that that, that was the most impacted area which is the front of the chair so we wanted to really be strategic on that area that we can actually avoid any type of impacts so those those lights are are integrated inside of that frame uh pointing forwards and basically a little um, leg strap has the battery box so with that battery box you actually have three modes you you either have uh, a dim light you've got the high beams and you click it again and you got in intermediate type of uh, lighting. Usually when you turn it on, you can easily see at least, I wanna say three feet in front of you. And I think that's a really cool innovative option that a lot of our wheelchair users are, are really excited about. Right now, the LED lights is only available on the nitro chairs. It is something that is retrofitable. So if somebody were to buy a regular nitro and six months, from now or a year from now, they actually saw the option on the website or they saw somebody out on the out on the street with the option, you can actually retrofit the LED lights into your Nitrum. All of the chairs from my Quickie portfolio are reimbursable under the uh, K0005 uh, HICPIC code. The website features a 3D visualizer where you can actually configure and really personalize your chair on the screen. So the actual user can actually configure their own Nitrum and, and really, if they wanted to, they want it, they can see it or they can show it in, in their environment via the augmented reality. And I think I can easily say this, that they we're the first to actually come up with this type of technology and, and right in time with this, with this current uh, 
pandemic situation that we're, <laughs> we're currently living on right now. And it's a great tool for a lot of the users, just because one of the things that really an end user often asks to their dealer or their therapist is that, what's my chair going to really look like? The cool thing about it is that it works by really going through the different aspects of the chair. So you first got to choose what type of frame do you want? What type of color? Luckily, we have all of the open colors right there. What type of fork? What type of caster? What type of wheels? And then you start playing around with the different options and you can easily spin around and really have it say, oh, okay, uh, look, looks cool. You print out the PDF and you basically you can go to your therapist and say, hey, this is the configuration that I really look that I really like. And let's 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 make it happen. So when you go to Sunrise Medical and you drive directly to the Nitrum uh, section of, of the website, if you scroll down, you start seeing the different uh, media specifications, support and features that you would normally see on, on the chair. But if you just stop right here and where it says 3D Visualizer and click start, so this is the, all the different options that you can play around with. Now, you will not see any sizing or any pricing. So is this, is this just the different configurations on the options? So again, you can scroll here, play around. Uh, this is the open frame. Okay, I want to play around with the hybrid. Okay, you can see the extra tube that you see right here. I'm going to put it on the side view. Okay, this is an 80. Uh, I want a frame angle of 75. What does that, does that do to the actual chair? Pulled it up a little bit more forward. Okay, I want an 85. Look at what's going to happen here. It pulled it a little, a little bit to the back. So this, this way you will see what the impact between 75 and 80 and 85 frame angle is going to do depending on, on what you ask. Okay, the other thing, uh, let's say you want to play around with the inset. Okay, you know what? I don't want this uh, two inch inset. I probably would just want straight here. So I want zero inset, but okay, you know what, Jesus may put a little bit of inset in there. Let's see how it would look like. Okay, you got in 75 degrees, one inch inset. Uh, you know what, uh, let's play around with the colors because I really like uh, somewhere along with my favorite team. Okay, you can customize the color of your frame, put a different color to the backrest. Maybe you can do the decal on a different color. You can actually go wild with the different combinations that, 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 you're, that you're going with. You know what, I wonder, I wanna see how it looked like with the LED lights. So this is where I was talking about, about the location of the LED lights. Right now, the Nitrum is the only chair that I know of here in North America that has a 3D visualizer that you can configure your chair online. The Wheelchair Comparison Web Series, brought to you by the Christopher and Dana Reeve Foundation and Gold Pictures.